CVA's Acura Series, Vergara barrels for guaranteed accuracy, nitride for guaranteed rust proofing, and a rifle guaranteed to be the best muzzle loader you've ever shot. CVA, it's just a better gun. This segment is being sponsored by Mowing and More, proudly serving Wilson County for over 15 years. Give them a call for all of your lawn care, landscaping, and irrigation needs. All right, this week's recipe of the week is being brought to you by Courtney's Restaurant and Catering. And that's at uh, 4066B North Mount Juliet Road, the city between the lakes. The beautiful city between the lakes. Beautiful city between the lakes. That's what I was told. That's, I mean, that's what they say. Well, it was all white this week. <laughs> it's <laughs> frozen white. like this week. But it looks a lot like any other place around yeah. here. It's <laughs> all white. <laughs> so, but Tom Courtney has graciously infected us with, <laughs> with the flu. Uh, he's here tonight. I ain't eating this week's recipe. No, we can't do it. We have to tell folks how to do it. Later yeah, on. no. That's going in the garbage. <laughs> <laughs> can't catch a break. I'll tell you, Tom. I, I feel like Rodney Dangerfield. Let me Thanks. tell you, Tom. No I respect. The I get it. I do. I really appreciate the loyalty. But you could have kept it at the house. <laughs> well, I wouldn't miss the show for nothing. See? Anything. See, I there love you go. the way he's thinking. I just wish he wouldn't thank you. That's right. He's That's on right. a Tamiflu high, y'all. That's right. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm running for office. What you got, Tom? Uh, Tamiflu. No. Uh, I got a <laughs> Tamiflu casserole. That's what yeah. Tamiflu casserole. <laughs> if you, for those of you that haven't had the flu, <laughs> feel grateful. Come anyway. to Courtney's. <laughs> <laughs> this is terrible. All right. Anyway, it's not terrible. Actually, this is pretty good. It's one of my favorite dishes there, Hugh. And this is chicken and wild rice casserole. Is it and, got the big man seasoning in it? Now it's got fat man seasoning in it. <laughs> and it does have fat man seasoning in it. It's okay. very good. Okay. All right. Anyway, we, we start out with Uncle Ben's wild rice. That's the best wild rice to use. And uh, we do. We let it simmer for about 20 minutes on the crock pot. We use a stick of butter in it. And we like to add a little bit of chicken base or chicken stock. Swanson. Swanson's makes a chicken stock at Kroger's that suffices perfectly. Uh, I cook all my vegetables at the restaurant and uh, just about everything with either chicken stock or a vegetable stock we create ourselves. And uh, it does make a heck of a difference. Anyway, you know, at the end of the uh, Thanksgiving holiday or at the end of the holidays in general, you always have a, a protein laying around. It could be turkey, ham, it could be anything. Ours is chicken. Yeah. And what we like to do is we like to shred that chicken that's already cooked and we'll throw it in with the uh, rice and let it simmer and simmer down good. And then we'll take a can of creamy mushroom soup, simple basic stuff, add it inside of it and then we'll take black pepper, your desire how much uh, and how, how spicy you want to make it. You may even cheat and get a little bit of fat man like he talked about or uh, uh, so it Frank, me out uh, hey, that Frank's, <laughs> Frank's hot sauce, it kills it. But Louisiana's my favorite. Tabasco. Tabasco. It's huge favorite. Brandon oh, likes what? I'm gonna have to go abandon because you guys. Man, I mean, can't you guys? I mean, <laughs> man, see, I'm looking for a Tennessee brand, and you guys can't come up. Bendigers of Wilson County. That's brand, brother. Wilson County, my <laughs> man. There it is. That's what we do. Use what you like, folks. Really, uh, I don't really like to get into the cheese on this. This is a non-cheese uh, product for me at Courtney's, uh, but we do like to put a cornbread topping on the on the top as you can well see it's a very good product um, put it in the oven for about maybe 30 minutes keep in mind the chickens already cooked you want to cook your chicken first you could boil it you could fry it you can do whatever you want to the chicken but please pull it off the bone and be careful when you do and shred it mix it in with that rice cook it down and here you go you got one of your poor boy favorites right here okay chicken and wild rice casserole a little bit of mushroom and it hey, Tom, can't it's go wrong. Be, it's good it's, stuff. It's got to be good for when you feel bad, too, because chicken, Amen, brother. the broth and all that's supposed to be good for you. All the, all the good stuff. Yeah. It really is, man. It, and it's uh, down home. Uh, one of those things you just throw together in the last minute. It's one of my favorite dishes. And all it's right. always better the next day. There you well, go. Tom Courtney, we appreciate Tom appreciate being, being here. here. We wish you left the flute to us, but <laughs> But we yeah. got to go. We got well, a giveaway. We got a giveaway to do show. tonight. We got a giveaway tonight. So we got a pack. We do a family pack of four tickets. How many? Four. So to go two adults. Two adults. 
two kids. Two, two kids. Or now, remember, 12 and under, they're free anyway. Yeah, you can be the 12 so, and under. Uh, we got a, invite we got two a, other adults. That's right. So we got a pack of four. Be the fifth caller. 737-7767, and we'll get those right there to you. All right. We're going to take a break, and when we come back, we're going to get a little bit of a calendar left, and then uh, we'll talk just a little bit more, but come on back to Southern Woods and Waters. 